Shepard, it's good to see you again. So, what can I do for you? How's your own work going? Everyone needs information, Shepard. You want to know why I don't drop everything to join you? I need to get that data. It should be about friendship, or trust. But that's not the way it works on Ilium. Let me know when you hack those terminals. Give me that, and I can talk to you. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there, if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. I'll talk to you later, Liara. What do you want? Sorry, sorry, that damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. The Krogan is reading those love poems to get your attention? His All name is Char. We're kind of dating, but, well, we're on a break. Deep. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. Let our scorching sun and Why are the two of you on a break? Turn your he's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, to but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. Uh, no offense. It made me wonder if he really likes me. Or if he just wants kids, he can't have them any other way, you know. Because of the genophage. You need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Look at him. He's obviously crazy about you. Is he? I mean, what if he just wants to have kids? Am I just his baby-making machine? He said I wasn't, but... If he said that, then you either trust him, so you have nothing to worry about, or you don't, and you've already decided. I, I guess I hadn't thought about it like that. And I do trust him, if he said it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help. Shepard. It's good to see you again. Thank you for getting me that system data. Here. It's not much, but hopefully it will help you on your mission. Do you remember the Shadow Broker? With the data you got me, I may be able to find information caches from his agents. Are you on the run from the Shadow Broker? I can help you. Actually, it would be more accurate to say that the Shadow Broker is on the run from me. We crossed paths not long after you died. Since then, I've been working to take him down. With this data, I'm a step closer. You can't come with me because you're after the Shadow Broker? What if I help you find him? I'm sorry, Shepard. The galaxy doesn't work that way. I need to find leads, trace information. I need to work. I can't do that on the Normandy. I wish I could. I've never seen you ready to execute someone in cold blood. What did the Shadow Broker do to you? I was on a job with a friend. The Shadow Broker's people caught us. My friend didn't escape. I don't know if he's dead or being interrogated. But I need to find him. I owe him my life. And I need to make the Shadow Broker pay for what he did. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I will. No. Is there anything else I can help you with? I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus gave me data on where to find him. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So you rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. 
You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. I didn't know how you'd feel when Cerberus restored you. If you'd feel betrayed, or... They brought you back. And now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Sounds like you and Farron were close. It's funny. He betrayed me more than once. He was double dealing for Cerberus, for the Shadow Broker. But in the end, he sacrificed himself for me. I owe him. Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. Excuse me. You know where I can find Serena? She's not here anymore. Oh, you're the one she was helping out. She took a job off-world. Didn't say where. She gave me something for you. Looks like a message. She didn't say anything else? She just gave me that and left. Not even a goodbye. Hey, Shepard. I was on my way to a new life when the new burst arrived. The bitch is dead. I assume that means your friend is alive and he finished his job. Tell him if I ever see him, I'll buy him a drink. Seal off those trace samples and get them back to the lab. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Central, we got an open carrier on this end. Switching to a coded relay. What's going on? This area is sealed off. Please step back, sir. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. You can't do that. Already done. Tila Vasir, Special Tactics and Recon. A Spectre? I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. So, I assume you had business with your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tassoni better than I do. Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. Those things must be worth a fortune. Vasir, I've got something here. Backup disk? Let's try it on her terminal. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sikat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Area Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony, you're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. This must be important. The Shadow Broker's people already tried to kill her once. I know where the Dracon Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go.
The Barrier Frontiers offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. Liara's in there! They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. I'll grab this guy car and seal off the building from the top. I'll start down here and work my way up. Just leave some for me. Oh god. What's happening? What happened? If I'd have been a few seconds faster, I could have stopped them. Is this a get? Must have been. No sign of that data Liara talked about. Looks like a dead end. Uh, speaking of which, did you find your friend's body? You mean this body? Liara! This is Vasir. She's a specter. This is the woman who tried to kill me. You've had a rough day, so I'll let that slide. Why don't you put that gun down? I saw you. I doubled back after I left. I watched you break into my apartment. You didn't know where Liara went, because she hid the message. You needed me to find it for you. Thanks for the help. Once she had my location, she signaled the Shadow Broker's forces. They bombed the building to take me out. She found Zakat, took his data, and killed him. I'm guessing she's still got the disc on her. Good guess. Not that you'll ever see what's on it. You pure blood dick! Fine, by the way. Thanks for asking.
There she is. Hang a right. No wait left. I'm on her. Hang a left. She's around the corner. We're not going into the construction site, are we? Oh, goddess. She's got reinforcements! What kind of guns does this thing have? It's a taxi. It has a fare meter. Truck. I know. Truck! I know. <sighs> there we go. You're enjoying this. at this speed. Yeah, I hear those can be bad for you. Truck! Again? Watch out. I've crashed on Azure. Get me some damn backup. people that you want to live please we'll get you out of here safely Mariana well that's good to hear all you had to do was walk away now it gets ugly please I have a son a son I hope he gets to see you again I've heard losing a parent is just horrific for children scars them for life I'm going to end you Fazir it's okay Liara we'll handle it the usual way. You want Mariana's little boy to grow up without a mommy, Shepard? Thermal clips on the ground now. Power cells too. Is that it? What? Vasir, I sacrificed hundreds of human lives to save the Destiny Ascension. I unleashed the Rachni on the galaxy. So for your sake, I hope your escape plan doesn't hinge on me hesitating to shoot a damn hostage. You're bluffing. Now, Liara. Keep up! 
the cat's personal data pad. This has what we need to find the Shadow Broker. You're dead. The Shadow Broker has been at power for decades. He's stronger than anything you've ever faced. Is that why you sold out the Council to work for him? You think I betrayed the Council? Like Saren? Go to hell. The Broker's given me damn good intel over the years. Intel that saved lives and kept the Citadel safe. So if the Broker needs a few people to disappear, I'll pay that price without hesitation. Spectres don't blow up buildings filled with innocent people. Sure we do. We get our hands dirty so the Council doesn't have to. The Councilors might complain about our methods to soothe their consciences, but they never look too closely. Besides, you're with Cerberus. You have any idea what your terrorist friends have done? I know who they are and what they've done. It doesn't matter. I think it does. You want to judge me? Look in the mirror. Kidnapping kids for biotic death camps? Killing Alliance admirals who ask questions? And you're with them? Don't you dare judge me. Don't you? The Seer's dead. I'm putting the data through to the Normandy's computers. We can be at the Shadow Broker's base in a few hours. He'll know about Vizier before long. If he decides to kill Farron. We'll get Farron out of there alive, Liara. I promise. I know. You're here to help. Just like always. That's not a good thing? When we first met on Therum, you saved me from the Geth. You fought a Krogan Battlemaster while I cowered. Now you're doing it again, and I'm still leaning on you for help. That's what friends do, Liara. I can get us there based on Sakat's data. The Normandy stealth drive will keep them from detecting us. The Shadow Broker's agents are still shooting their way through Ilium. With luck, they won't notice we've left until it's too late. That's a little cold. They killed innocent people. You know what I mean. Do I? When I hit the ground back at the Trade Center, you went after Vizier without a backward look. A little fall wasn't going to kill you. I had to stay on Vizier. I had to stay rational, make the call, like I did with Sakat. That's Vizier's fault, not yours. Sakat had no idea what the stakes were. I put him in harm's way to get the data I needed. I got him killed. And I'd do it again. But from here on out, things will be simple. Get in, get Farron, get out. ...and kill anyone who tries to stop us. That's it? That's it. Will you just stop for a second? We'll be jumping several light years. There's time to talk. About what? You haven't been the same since I came back, Liara. What do you want me to say, Shepard? That I mourned you? That I feel guilty because Farron got captured? I made mistakes. I lost people. I helped get you back. And I want to do the same for Farron. I'll sit and talk once he's safe. Until then, enjoying the scenery is an insult to the man who saved both of us. Okay, let's go. lives in this? His ship follows the sunset, completely undetectable in the storm, unless you know where to look. How do we get inside? The shuttle bay is locked down. We'll need to land on the ship and hunt for a hatch. But we can't stay outside for long. There's a constant lightning storm where the hot and cold air collide.
Not even a guardrail. I bet the broker's agents love patrolling the hall. Locked. Hang on, I've got a bypass shunt program that can crack it. How long will it take? I don't know, Shepard. I've never broken into the Shadow Broker's base before. Well, not this one, anyway. You sure that shunt is working? It's illegal, even on Ilium. It didn't come with a warning. But you tested it, right? Here come more of them! Tell me you tested it. No time to talk. Take you test. You say you stay out of your way. I'll hire it. Monitor. seen it. I told you. Hold your positions, no matter the cost. Farron. Liara? Hold on. We're getting you out of here. No. Farron. What the hell is the broker trying to do to you? The equipment is sensitive to tampering. This chair plugs into the broker's info network. You have to shut off the power. Pull me out now and my brain cooks. Do you know where we can cut the power? It won't be easy. You'll have to go to Central Operations. What's the point of this cage? I don't... It's a neural grounding rod. The medical equipment is to make sure he doesn't... expire. We have to shut this place down. Where did the broker get the mercs? Raised his own private force. They're completely loyal. Uh, uh, Shepard, we really don't have the time. Easy or not, we're all getting out of here. Good. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll be back for you, Farron. I'll try not to go anywhere. I want all teams to outpost C. Sensor contact. Reinforcing shields. You're from the drill. 
not reckless. Just determined. Ask your Asari Spectre about that. Masu was expendable. All her death cost me was time. Expendable like Farron? Dr. Dasoni, your interference caused all this. Farron betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The Drell is simply paying the price. Someone was bound to come after you for working with the Collectors. It was a mutually beneficial partnership. Fortunately, the Normandy's IFF will let me salvage the remains of the Collector's base. It'll be pretty hard to run a base this size with no crew. They're replaceable. Your arrival is barely an interruption. Enough talk. My operations are too crucial to be compromised by a traitor. You're quite confident for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. Thank you for bringing me the guests to Sony. Cerberus undervalued its selling price. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg, a pre space flight species quarantined to their homeworld from massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery, which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago. Then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. How am I doing? Genetically sensitive. Energy and projectiles are bouncing off. Then we do this the hard way.
Taking over as the Shadow Broker really a good idea? It was either that or lose everything. His contacts, his trading sources, those will really help us. With the Shadow Broker's information network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll check the power systems. Stay here? I could use you on the Normandy. I have to stay here. We can't pass this up, Shepard. All I wanted was to rescue Farron, but is it wrong that part of me wants this? With the Shadow Broker's network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Come by when you have a chance. The doors are always open. Stop by. We don't get many visitors. Take it easy. You've been through a lot. You're probably right. I never did say thanks for the rescue. Liara never gave up on you, Farron. I just helped. I'm still amazed Liara came for me. I'll never forget what either of you did. I can log that in the archives for you, sir. I see you met the secretary. For two years, Liara didn't stop looking for you. You two must have been close. She's a good friend. Better than I deserve. Take it easy, Farron. Thanks. How are you doing, Liara? I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. He had top-level access to the Turian and Asari governments. And more than one Solarian Dalatros traded intel. And now it's ours. You're not gonna turn into a recluse with creepy information on everyone in the galaxy, are you? I can understand the temptation. I've got all the secrets of the galaxy at my fingertips. Give me ten minutes and I could start a war. But I've got a purpose. Helping you stop the Reapers. That will keep me honest. You know, relatively speaking. Have you found anything useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. 
He didn't want Saren to succeed. He also knew that the Collectors were Protheans, repurposed to be Harbinger's puppets. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. Why was he still looking at Protheans? They gave us the warning and the conduit at Ilos, but we've used those. The Shadow Broker seemed to think there was more out there. Perhaps the Protheans had other plans. Or maybe he was just grasping at anything that offered some hope. How do you know what the Shadow Broker was? I didn't. I had no idea what to expect when we finally found him. But I researched pre-spaceflight cultures during some of my Prothean studies. I know a bit about the Yogg. There's more on the terminals if you want to look. They're a fascinating culture, and a terrifying one. How's Farron doing? As well as you'd expect, after two years of intermittent torture. You gonna be okay? I don't know. He wants to work, so I'm letting him help. Maybe it takes his mind off it. So, you and Farron? No. He's been through a traumatic ordeal. He's emotionally fragile and needs to heal. He's very grateful to me for saving him. But it would be irresponsible of me to take advantage of that. It was good talking with you, Liara. Let me know if you need anything. I think what I need right now is a friend. I can't leave for too long, but spending all my time on this ship. Maybe next time you come by, I could come up to the Normandy. That sounds great. Why don't you come up now? Okay, thanks. I'll be right there. Just give me a minute. Did you enjoy the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship. And I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me. Although, he did ask if I'd embraced eternity lately. <sighs> of course he did. I also spoke with Dr. Chalkwaz. I'm glad she's doing well. I brought you something. It took some digging, but I recovered your tags. I thought I'd never see these again. They changed hands more than once. Do you remember Admiral Hackett? He gave them to me so I could return them to you. He sends his best and hopes you're okay. So how are you doing, Shepard? I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. Between you and me? I have no idea how we're gonna do this. I'm doing everything I can, but... You've done more than most. You and your team destroyed the Collectors and walked out alive. We bought them in their own base, and we won. They can't call us young or primitive anymore. Young? You know, I'm 108. 109 in a couple of months. I should get you something nice. You're alive again. I've got everything I want. So tell me what you want. What are you fighting for? The future of humanity, as evidenced by the perfect Miss Lawson? I guess I'm fighting for us. All of us. That's a lot of responsibility. People are messy, awkward, sometimes selfish or cruel. But they're trying. And I'm gonna make sure they have a chance. I hope the galaxy proves itself worthy of the effort you're putting into saving it. I should get back to my base, but thanks for inviting me up, Shepard. Come back soon. <laughs>